Alexa, good morning. Good morning and happy leap day. Now my wheels in motion and my windows open with the wind blowing in my head. I'm driving down the highway, gonna do this my way. I can feel it in the air. Here I go. Welcome to Thursday. How are we all doing today? Yeah, and welcome to the vlog. It's a bit wet and soggy out there at the minute. It's doing that fine, horrible, drizzly rain where I find where you get more soaked rather than this complete utter downpour. So I did check Alexa and it is supposed to stop raining and the sun's supposed to come out later on this afternoon. So I hope, fingers crossed, it does. Again, like I said, we want to start doing some work on the garden, but we just can't at the moment because it's just like a complete and utter bog basically will get absolutely covered in mud that sort of thing so and knowing that we don't really want to do much to it at the minute like i said we're in the rain and stuff like that so because hopefully fingers crossed somewhere in the next few months or some definitely sometime this year we're going to get the trees cut and we're going to move the fence over so yeah basically it's just and then like trying to tidy up the general maintenance of it really but again you can't do it because it's just like a bog so um, but anyway, yeah, kids went off to school absolutely fine this morning. I'm not too quite sure what they're doing. I know Sammy was, like I say, he was definitely looking forward to school. And with Ben, I'm not too quite sure what he was doing today. Just totally different things, that sort of thing. I remember this, I remember Sammy say something about going out into town or something. So, yeah, no doubt he'll tell us when he comes in from school a little bit later on. So, yeah, I had to wake him up. I, in fact, I had to wake both of them up this morning, to be honest with you. I think because obviously it's getting to be, I don't want to say they're getting to love their sleep, because obviously Sam has always had to do sleep ever since he was a baby. He was sleeping three from ten weeks, and that was it, basically. But yeah, um, I think because, like Sam said, he was so comfortable, bless him. He wants me to change his bed later on. He wants his London duvet back on this bed I said yeah I'll do that for you and um, definitely had to wake Ben up this morning like, he, cause he, even though he went to sleep early last night I still had to wake him up ready for school I think because like, the night before he actually woke up a quarter to four that morning and then, like I said I'm really quite surprised we didn't get a phone call from school yesterday saying oh Ben's falling asleep but no yeah, he actually fell asleep last night watching the football bless him yeah, um, because it was on ITV, um, Steve Ben could watch it in his, in his bedroom. And then, yeah, he was asleep by what, past 20 past nine last night. So, yeah, um, so to him this morning, no, Liverpool won um, last night. And the smile went on his face, bless him. So, yeah, he absolutely loves watching his football with daddy. So, it'd be nice if we could get him tickets to go up to Liverpool and actually see a game. But it's just crazy how you can get tickets and stuff so possibility of going to like some local football and stuff like that so again it's just a question of affording it all there because tickets are so expensive even for like Northampton Town, Milton Keynes, Don, what MK Dons, Hawkshire United they're still £25-30 a ticket it's like I said this crazy price it really really is but anyway yeah plans for me today is obviously um just got my job to do this morning, like the dishwasher, the washing machine, that sort of thing. I was I'm in an army about putting my washing out. It's only some towels and stuff, but it's like if it rains again, I'm infection in that sort of thing. But also later on when I finish work, I pop down to mum's. Obviously, we had took some some down the row of Disney pictures, and I said to Becca, does she want them from Mia's room? So yeah, got the old Winnie the Pooh one there eating his honey, and then I've got this one just here for her as well so i said she she was welcome to them because like i said if the one them i just go off them on local freebie site for free to be honest i can't even remember where i got them from i've had them that long 
I think today I forgot from the charity shop or car boot sale. I really, really can't remember. But like I said, how we've done the wall now looks so much better in there. It really, really does. But anyway, yeah, I'm going to go drink my tea now. And like I said, get these few jobs done in the house. Before I know it, it will be time for me to head to work. Alexa, good morning. Good morning and happy Leap Day. People born on February 29th are called Leaplings. Apparently, there are 4.8 million of them around the world. Okay. So, yeah, so Thursday's gone quite quickly, don't you think so? Yeah, it's Miserable day, you know. It started to rain again, things like that. It's supposed to be spring. Well, meteorically, it's spring on tomorrow, isn't it? Friday. But then... Otherwise, we don't start spring till the 21st. It's weird how they say it starts the 21st, but the weathermen always say spring starts the 1st, isn't it? It's just crazy how it all works. Anyway, yeah, we just come back from Mum and Dad's. Obviously, took the few bits down we had. Obviously, there's picture frames for Amelia for a room. And also the sheets and duvets, and it? Took them down. So, they got a clothing bag tomorrow. We did get one. So, they're... Um, I'm going to put them out for us tomorrow because I haven't got a clue when we're going to get one. So, yeah, and bless her Amelia, isn't she, darling? She's growing up so, so much, isn't she? She really, really is. She is, how old is she? Eight months old? Yeah, she's eight, nine months old now. She was born in, she was born in June, so July, August, September, October, November, December, January, February. Yeah, five, six, seven, eight. We'll say eight and a half months old. And bless her, she is absolutely in to everything, isn't she? And um, she was laughing, giggling, got her to smile as well. And she's got one of those matte things, like those water matte things, doesn't she? And obviously, you play her on the tongue, she was there, like hitting it like this, getting all the creatures to move. But I've got a feeling next couple of weeks she's going to be crawling, isn't she? She's not going to be long before she's crawling. You put her on her tummy and she's there, her little knees come up and she's like wiggling her bum, moving away. But yeah, um, all I say is so look out when she starts to crawl. That's all I say, because like I said, she's into everything now. So when she starts crawling, she's going to be all over the place. And then, with the fun part, then when she starts pulling herself up and learning to walk, what? Mm. That's when you need to baby-proof any house, basically, is when they start to walk. But one tip we were told, though, as obviously when the kids are little, you get on that, you get on your hands and knees, then you look up at things. That's how a baby or a toddler actually sees things as well. So it's quite interesting, that is. Anyway, what's she saying, darling, about sad news? About Dave from Harry Yeah, um, where is it? the video? This DVD. Yeah, it's quite sad, actually, if you can remember the Harry Bikers. Which one? That was him, wasn't it? That one. Was it that one? Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. That was him, Dave from Harry Bikers. Yes, sadly, he passed away from cancer oh, yesterday. Um, when we went to the Good Food Show, we sort of saw um, the Harry Bikers, didn't we? Yeah. But only Cy was there, which was that one, wasn't it? Yeah. I can't see that properly, but yeah. Um, it's quite sad, actually, because we thought he'd beat cancer, didn't we? They were scheduled, yeah, they were scheduled to come back for the summer event, so I'm not too quite sure whether Sai is going to carry on without him or not. But yeah, it's quite sad actually, it really, really is. So, but anyway, yeah, um, now we're just going to chill out for a little bit actually, wait for the kids to come home and see what they've got up to at school. So, yeah, you can see the boys are home from school, and Ben's been out today, haven't you, Ben? Um, they come home with a couple of photos and it looks like he's been to Costa. I'll show you the photos in a minute because there's never kids on there or anything like that. So also looks like he's been to Hobbycraft as well, doesn't it? You know what they could be doing, don't you? Went to Hobbycraft and got some more supplies for their enterprise thing. Yeah. That's probably what they could have done. So what else do we have in Costa then, young man? Eh? <laughs> I had a bacon roll, I had a sausage roll. Probably I had a cake, I had a hot chocolate. Mm -hmm. Didn't you, Ben, probably? I had a bag of crisps. Yeah. A large mocha with extra chocolate and... No, the bag of crisps will... They've got the crisps will be tomorrow when they go shopping for oh. their for their lunch. Can have a luxury hot chocolate with the marshmallows and cream. <laughs> I know, that's <laughs> nice though, hot... You do have to make Costa is nice. Yeah, sometimes it can be just brown water. Mm. I know. I to think make a large hot chocolate, you've got to have three to four scoops of hot chocolate mm. in the cup yeah and then you're supposed to drop a bit of water in it whisk it with a little little uh, 
little like wooden doodah mm -hmm. and then you uh, and then you froth the milk and then you pour it on top. Uh, is that how you're making this? Is that how you make them at your place? Mm. Yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah. So that's why that's why you that's why when you do hot chocolates here, you're they're always nice. Yeah. The thing but. is, I do, do you prefer it with water? Or do you prefer it with milk? I don't know. Some hot chocolates you have to have with milk and some you have to have with chocolate. I don't think it really matters actually. But I'm always in the best place we've ever had hot chocolate and that's Cabby World. Yeah, Cabby World is a bit of a dive at the minute. Isn't it? it is a bit of a nightmare at the minute. We can't yeah. get... Because I think we could do... It's, since Marilyn took it over, it's, it's just not there anymore, is it? It's not so much that, Cabby, it's Cabby's, the fact of the matter is, there's only limited spaces, um, but... Someone posted a picture the other day saying they took away a lot of the uh, disabled spots because of work going on. Oh yeah, they're doing work, aren't they? They're doing that car ride, aren't you? That's going to be quite interesting. That's going to be a bit like Buzz at Disney, like gear thing. basically going where it was in that same bit? Yeah, but what you about, got... What about the rest of the attraction? That's I don't, not crap. I don't know, I can wait, I'll have to wait and see when we get back in November. But anyway, yeah, you'll see, like I said, Lee's friends had a really good day today. He's just tucking into his crisp. You so look yeah, tired your again, your sweeter. Your favourite things on again, Bluey. What's been my favourite things on again? What do you mean? <laughs> you were watching Bluey earlier on. I know I was. It was wet playtime, so I didn't mind watching Bluey. You didn't have to see movies on, then. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what they had on, but yeah, I was watching Bluey this afternoon. <laughs> I don't mind that actually going to work and sitting there and watching Bluey. Bluey. <laughs> now I want to see what the face. I know I know what the face is in Bluey. I still don't know any of the names, nothing like that for the characters. But yeah, I certainly enjoy watching that this afternoon. So, but anyway, like I said, Ben looks tired again. So, don't you, sweeter? We're all tired. We are all tired, actually. Oh. Doesn't this weather doesn't help, does it? You know. Right now, it's, the policy is a booking holiday. Is like I like you doing. I know it's just crazy. How can anyone know in January what they're going to be doing in December? It's crazy, isn't it? I hate it. I really do. It's just crazy how you do that. But I haven't got a proper week off until May. No, they haven't got a proper week. You've got the odd weekend off here, yeah, there, and everywhere. Enough. Well, it's different from having a week off, isn't it? It is. Yeah. Really is. But anyway, yeah, I'll show you these couple of these photos. Um, you can see that Ben in Costa. It looks like he's got an orange juice, doesn't it, in there? He does, like, stuck in some Mickey ears. He's got some bunny ears. Oh, yeah, and this is when we're in Hobbycraft. You can see Ben's actually got some bunny ears on top of his helmet. <laughs> That's quite cute, isn't it? So, um, but anyway, yes, Sammy. Anyway, Sammy, yeah. how was your day at school today? Good. You do anything interesting? Um, I've just been doing PE. Did you go out into town today? No. I thought you said just going out into town today. Yeah, I did. You did or you didn't? I did. Where did you go? Down the high street. What did you do down the high street? Thank you, Daddy. What did you do in the high street? Um, just went past all the shops. Well, what what shops? What, exactly. The empty, the empty ones. Yeah, it's empty that. So, welcome um, to 2024. Yeah. And why doesn't your teacher email anymore? Because my teacher wants to get home. That's, that's so funny, Sammy. She wants to get home. That is so, so funny. I'm quite surprised she hasn't got parents even yet, actually, to be honest with you. I know we've had one, haven't we? That was just before Christmas. So, we know. Probably on my next couple of weeks or so. So, anyway, yeah, see, so Sammy's actually playing Bluey. Right, so, tonight, isn't it? I want to get tea done. I want to get done. done. So, I want to go and have a nice soap because I'm just. Yeah, I know. Going to have a nice bath. Yeah. So, you yeah. should have had your bath last night, but you were watching Liverpool, weren't you, last night? Trouble of an hour at this time of year, those games are going to be coming like the clappers. Are they? Saturday, we're on a three o'clock blackout, so. Oh, well, okay. Find a stream. Mm. Things I don't understand. I love, I love finding a good stream because they're quite cool. Yeah. Things I don't understand why a three o'clock black off actually exists, you know? Because they reckon people are not going to go to the games. They want to try and show the rest of the world that everyone's going to matches. Is that what it is? I wish I could go to a blooming match. Well, no. so the thing is, I don't understand. Can you remember when Sky used to do that Prem Press season ticket? I don't understand why they you don't... Know, you don't want that more money-making schemes. No, yeah, but what I'm trying to say is I don't understand why each football club can't have their own app. You pay so much a month for this app, then you watch 
you know what Liverpool channel you've got well they don't do something like that where you can have the live matches on there all the time you know the trouble is you know everything's going to go up you watch TNT Sports go up next season it will do yes Sky's going up Disney Plus has gone up it's just crazy so but anyway yeah Ben don't forget your drinks on there sweetheart don't you drink that's got your medicine sweetheart so you need that you go yeah he was obviously he's getting wise to his medications being in his drinks and stuff so he's a bit and you know sometimes you can sort of like have to take lots of encouragement to take it that was that was not too bad because that one's a zinc and it's orange flavor so that doesn't make a difference but it's magnesium he has that could be a bit of a nightmare getting to him because again you can't mix that with anything it's got to be just for plain water so yeah, that needs a what's the matter ben yeah oh, sammy what game we downloaded there is that back to the future game uh, oh wow that looks pretty cool Oh wow, look at these graphics, darling. No, really, that really looks like Mighty McFly. <laughs> so, is this on the Game Pass, by the way, Sammy? Nah. Samuel. Uh, is, is this on the Game Pass? It's on the gold. What do you mean on the gold? It's part of the Game Pass. Oh, right, okay. So, yeah, but some, like, we are paid for the, the top Game Pass or something, but I don't know, so, yeah. Yeah, all these ideas I come up for games with, it's just crazy, though, isn't it? But anyway, yeah, so for tea, um, this is what for tea, obviously. Ben's got one of his gluten free pies here. This is mine, Stephen's pie. This is the MS Gastro. Is it the Gastro pub? Yes. Yeah, it's yes. one of their yes. steak yes. pie things. When we, gas. Yeah, when we went to MS last week, we actually got one of those pies. It's only, it's only supposed to serve two. But they're not very big, are they, so to speak, really? But they are really, really nice, though. Don't read the box, and then you'll find out how big it is. Exactly, yeah. And obviously, Sam has got one of his pies there as well. And then we've also got roast potatoes, and Seam's just going to get some veg as well. So it's a nice, easy dinner as well. So there's some mixed veg in there, or do you want the sweet corn? There is some mixed veg. Do mixed veg, you might as well, yeah. yeah. Well, Ashley Firm, that brings Thursday to an end once again, yeah, and apparently today, being Leap Day, February the 29th, this is the last time we're going to see the sun set at this time of day, which is 7 o'clock until October the 29th. What do you mean? It's the last, last, the sun set around 6 o'clock, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's the last time you're going to see it set at that time until the 29th of October. Because as we move into March, it starts to get longer oh, and longer it? and longer. Yeah. Oh, right, okay. Also, take, take the keys, also, I found out something today. It was National Toast Day today as well, apparently. National Toast. You know what sounds like with this toast? What toasties? Toast. Yeah, no, actually, toast, proper toast. <laughs> yeah, so today has just been a day of work, shower work, getting wet, rain, no. watching Bluey. <laughs> hey, I quite like Blue actually. After watching, after watching 40 minutes of Blue, we'd say I quite like Blue actually. It's quite yeah. interesting. So, I still don't know who any of the characters are. All I know, Blue is the blue thing. <laughs> have a go on that game. Sammy's got one there. Yeah, should do actually. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, went to see Amelia this afternoon. Bless her. Yeah, and she she was rolling around like buggery, wasn't she on the floor? She was. Yeah. She's got, I said she's got one of those mat things. Um, <laughs> Like I said, I don't give it on before she's crawling, to be honest with you. Right. She was trying to get on her knees, won't she, Ellie? Ron? I'll give her two months, two months at least. I give, oh yeah, two months max and she'll be crawling. Yeah. She will be definitely, but yeah. yeah. I said that to Becca, Becca goes, no! <laughs> and then when we left her, she was fast asleep. Yeah. Yeah, the boys come home, we're all our washes, and that ends another day. So like the video, comment down below, hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.